Well, hello everybody. Welcome to another wonderful day of Shalom Wars Adventure and Factorio here. Perfect. So what is going on? Where do we leave off? This whole contraption. So I've been kind of thinking about it. And what I've done, I think, is incorrect here. For now, it seems to work fine. But... Um, I have a better way of implementing all of this steel here where yeah right now it looks like it's working quite well actually I think it's all gonna stop pretty much here once um, so the problem oh, okay here we go There's some clogged okay so let's pick it up just in case okay so I'm probably gonna take this all apart because it kind of looks messy it's not exactly what I want, so let's start doing it from here. So let's take out these guys. So I apologize for some of the technical difficulties in the last episode. Um, I'm using a new recording device uh, for all of this. I'm using what's called, uh, it's called OBS. And it's a very cool open source uh, recorder. And so, yeah. So here we are doing this. Uh, let's take a look inside this box. Uh, maybe that's why it's not making anymore. This guy gonna grab any more iron? No, because he's not facing the right way. So yeah, we're gonna have to take this all apart. So. Probably we'll just leave it like this to run like this. I so my I might. Uh, uh, okay, so basically with some editing magic. <laughs> uh, so what are we doing here? Well, let's take this stuff apart, and we're going to try some new methods of doing this. I think. There's just a lot of steel here. Let's pick this up. Let's put this away. Even the coal might be have to be diverted. So I'm just going to take this stuff all apart here. And we'll just pick up all the steel here. Uh, I just push and hold F to pick up. And maybe I'll we'll leave it like that. We'll, we'll delete this one. I'm just going to delete this entire belt here because with the whole idea I have with this I should be able to bring the belts in closer so without further ado let's give this a shot again so I didn't realize that you can place these inserters kind of like this so if you notice you can have an inserter to pick up and put fuel in to these things okay and then if you notice we can put this inserter either here or here so what this will do is put them on a like an output belt here on the inside so to show you that we'll bring it down this way okay and we're going to do the, that exact same thing on this side here. So what we do is we're taking this stuff apart. As we're grabbing these plates here. These undergrounds. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of this one. Okay. Let's grab this stuff here. Okay. So this is producing what it's producing, the red stuff for the shotgun shell shooting speed. I think we got the other weapons now. Let's take a look at that. Yeah, okay, looks like we do. We got the submachine gun, which is a little bit better. Let's build one of those, and let's even build a shotgun for the heck of it. Since we got two slots down here. The regular gun, the regular pistol doesn't really matter, I don't think. Uh, transfer belt can't be used with a weapon, no duh. Let's see, maybe we can do that. Put that there. Uh, shotgun. We need to build shotgun ammo then. So, let's do 10 of these. Of these. 6, 8, 9, 10. Just see what that does. 
Um, we got these turrets still. How many do we have? We got four of them. I think I need more materials. And this is out fuel, so let's pop some fuel in there. I'm going to have to change the you know, how this all operates as well, uh, because I do want to use it still. Um, it's a good idea for the copper a stream. You eventually we'll have to you know, tap into all this copper here for all the other copper things we need to do. So anyways, back to uh, building this since I get distracted terribly easy. Uh, okay, so we gotta do the same thing. We gotta put the output like so. So let's start with this side. I can do that, that, and run one right there. Okay, now there you go. Now it's back in operation. Perfect. Same idea here again. We'll have to put, uh, let's see, where's it? Transport belts right here. I think that's four. Okay, so transport belts just like this going down the other way. And we're going to do the exact same th thing. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, it's the stupid power pole. So. Let's do this. Let's put the power pole like this. Okay, we'll probably have to reevaluate these power poles. I don't think we need too many of them, but ah, it doesn't matter. So, anyways, let's bring this stuff this way. Okay. And actually, the funny part is is we'll be able to oh no we won't be able to merge it I don't think crap ah we'll kind of be able to ah crap no we won't okay so there has to be a better way of doing this um let's pop this back a bit okay Let's check out this thing. So we put all of our coal that we had into the uh, this guy. And we still got some coal that we pick up because of picking up off the belts. Yeah, okay, so let's take this apart. Since the plates have already moved on up here. Okay, so now... Now, I know you can put plates down, I just don't know how, unless it's like this. And I don't know. I don't know how to do that. It's interesting. Okay. So, I need to merge this into here somehow. What is the best way of doing that? Well, this thing might need to be relocated. So, let's do that. Let's relocate this, this thing here right there okay and then we can put a belt like this like this pick that up and let's get rid of that belt and then we can do that okay and if we pick that stuff up okay and then we just add this belt in voila okay so we kind of gave us a little bit more space. What I want to do here is actually uh, put it through oh, just like this. And what's going to happen is this stuff is going to push onto this other lane and then we can go underground. Okay, just to here. Perfect. And then we can turn it this way, straight up this way. Perfect. Now we can return that inserter here to create the ammo. Perfect. And now we can actually think of making maybe other kinds of ammo. Uh, let's see here. We still have the regular magazine. Uh, okay, no. We still have the regular kind of stuff. Let's build a few of these. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, good. So look, this is looking good. Oh, I don't have any of these guys. So let's do this, this, and that. Let's see how this looks now. So it's going to go underneath, it's going to go up, and it's going to double up. Beautiful. 
And so there we go. <laughs> so that's a good kind of little redesign of everything. And working very nicely. So now here, research wise, this is almost going to be done. So research, we'll have quite a bit of research here to look at. So this is almost done, the shooting speed. Uh, we can't do the turret upgrade. We'll be able to do the shotgun shell damage. We'll be able to do the bullet shooting speed, the bullet damage. And then I think everything then starts to need to have the green bags or the green science packs. And we're going to need to make steel at some point. So, so that way we, we can make cars, I think. I think we should make a vehicle to kill off the guys. So yeah, so we're going to have to look at those science packs here. Maybe kind of create a way to change all this here. So how are we going to change that? Well, what do we need for the science packs? Let's take a look here. I'm just trying, oh, here we go. So science packs look li looks like they need transport belt and an and, and inserter. So transport belts. So what do we need to make those guys? So basically, yeah, that's what you do in this game. <laughs> so we need iron plate and iron gear wheels. So this guy, we're going to probably want to output a different way. Let's just output him. This is going to be sloppy, but what the hell, it doesn't matter. So let's do it like this. Maybe one, two, three. And then bring it up this way. Take that out. And we'll change that one to be like this. Okay. And of course we'll have to change the, the whole po power pole thing. So let's just put that one there for now. And now we're going to put gears here. Okay. So now we need iron plates. So what are we going to do with that? So let's split it up. Ah, shoot, I didn't need to build that. Anyways, so what we'll do is we'll take apart a piece here, put it there so it splits it up. And then we'll be able to take these plates. Actually, let's bring it up this way. Okay. So now, this is exciting. Okay, so now we need belts. So, the craft items require up to two ingredients. Oh, the technology is done. Good, good, good. So let's do bullet shooting speed. Maybe we'll do bullet damage. And yeah, maybe we'll do bullet damage because we have the machine gun. And then we can do the bullet speed. Uh, but anyways, back to this. So to make these, we need two items. So we can make a regular assembling machine. Okay. Once that's made here, I'll be able to place that. I don't know where I want to place that. And oh yeah, we need to make those inserters as well. So those need some circuits. Which means to make circuits, we're going to need copper and iron. Shit. Yeah, man. Organization. <laughs> this game has some crazy organization stuff. So, how are we going to do this? I might have to split the plates again. So, let's see if I put this here to here. Okay. And then let's, let's see here. Let's put this. I'm just thinking here because we need all three types basically, right? So, for example, the circuits. If you want to make those, we need iron plates and copper cables. To make copper cables, we need iron uh, copper plates. And right now, this is going just single it's you're, you're turning to this what I need to do is turn this side into this side kind of with the furnaces 
I don't think I have any other kinds of furnaces yet. Yeah, just the stone furnaces still. So one, uh, two, three, four, five, six. Maybe we'll do six. We'll have a similar operation on the copper side as as the the iron side. Maybe we'll move it up higher here. So let's do this. Let's take this off yeah let's take that away now once it takes this last copper here we'll take that away that maybe we'll even take that away and let's kind of reposition where we're going to put the the copper stuff let's make a couple of these as well so we got one two three four i think four will be enough uh, we only have two on this side but whatever Okay, excuse me, I had to cough there. Hopefully this this mute works this time. Okay, and uh, we need, yeah, okay, three, four. Okay, so where are we gonna do this? Maybe we'll just do it on both sides going straight down. So for example, if we go like this, go on. two right and then we go one two okay and then we'll bring a belt Let's see going down here it may be yeah that's fine we could probably actually let's bring it up this way Okay, I'm gonna actually rip this all up here, and we're gonna put it over up here. Actually, I think. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. That'd be a lot better. Um, drop that. Let's, let's pick this stuff up. Okay. So what we'll do is we want to utilize all this copper. So I'm just gonna kind of, okay, no, that's not gonna work. I guess it doesn't matter. We'll have to use a method to, to merge it all, but that's okay. So let's try and fit as many as we can into this deposit. I think we could do, yeah, that. Okay, perfect. Now I've grabbed these. I'm just going to check my clock here. Oh, so it looks like we got about 11, 12 minutes left. Well, hopefully you're enjoying this this episode. Uh, hopefully it's recording well. Um, using the OBS is kind of neat. Kind of fun at the same time. Okay, let's bring this down this way. And I think here we'll put our, our array. So, for example, we'll just do it the same way. We'll have the main resource coming down the middle here. Okay, and then we'll add in our our furnaces. We need one more furnace. Okay, let's put these furnaces in play. We need one, two, three, four, uh, four, five, six. Okay, be it'd be exact same thing as down here. And of course we want uh, inserters to insert all of the copper here. I can't wait for electric furnaces, man. I think we can do that. And it should still pick it up. Yeah, it looks like it's the same way. Okay, once we got those like that, now we're going to need the long-armed ones. So long-armed inserters, where are you? Right here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We need a bunch of those because they're just as important. And so once we have our cop our copper production doing the same thing like the iron plates, I think we'll be moving this whole research lab uh, facility thing here. Uh, let me 
do... Oh, did I not have any more? Okay, well, now I got more. So this one, let's do this again so it continues to create the, uh, the red uh, research bags. We shouldn't let that stop us. I think this will should function. Yeah, okay, good. That's all working as, as expected. Perfect. So back up to here. Uh, since we made a bunch of these guys now, now we can do exactly like what it is down there. Um, I might bring up you know, these two trains up top there as well. But I'm not too sure because it's kind of far away from the coal. I guess I could do another split and then bring it up this way. Maybe we'll do that. Maybe, yeah, maybe. let's do that here. Let's build some more of these. Okay. And then let's start pulling it up. So let's split it again. So what this does, I was wrong with it, um, with how it operated, or how I mentioned earlier in one of my earlier episodes of how this worked. This is actually splits up the, the streams into two streams. So kind of like you can, so like, this stream comes up, 50% of it goes this way, the other 50% of it goes this, it goes this way. And then we have another stream now here, which will 50% of it will go this way, 50% will go up that way. So same idea here, 50% that way until the end there. So let's bring the belt up and go straight. We can go underground, I hope. Hopefully I can make it. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. So this is as I feared. It's going to be so messy, but it's going to work. <laughs> so let's try this again. Turn it. And then we turn it back that way. We go past those guys. Okay, and then we go underneath. Okay, and then we bring it straight up this way. Ooh, is it right beside or one, two, three, the fourth one? Okay, one, two, three. One, two, three, okay. <laughs> one, two, three, four. Okay. That looks about right. Do the same thing on this side. One, two, three, fourth. We bring it down. So we'll, basically, what's going to have to happen about, I don't know about where, but probably about here. We're going to take this and we're going to split the stream. Bang. And then we'll, we'll carry the one stream this way. Okay. And then the other stream which we need more of these guys. I need a whole lot of these guys. And I'm going to throw the stuff I have into there. How about coal? Yeah, well this will all be obsolete soon so I think this is pretty much done so let's pick this up. We can pick this one up, and then this will get used up as long as that goes. Okay, so back up to here. So we got that side done. Now we got this side done. Go up this way. Bang, 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 bang. And there we go. Now we got beautiful coal, which is fuel. Which means now I can go doop, 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 doop. Okay, so now we need power. <laughs> we need to bring power all the way up. Not a problem. So we'll put power, power pole here. And I can put a power pole here, I think.
And then we'll have to put a couple power poles. We'll have to put one here. And we'll have to put one here. And we'll have to put one probably about here for all three of them. Okay, perfect, perfect. Then we need to bring power up here to power those, and then to power those. Okay, perfect. Now we can drop a light. I want a light about here. Beautiful. I love, I love the area that it lights up. It lights up such a huge area. I can put a light here. So we can see what we're doing. So let's check this map out. See if we can spot any more iron deposits. I think we have some up here. Which means we'll have to take those guys out on the left there. And up top. And hopefully everything else leaves us alone in the meantime. And then we'll have to kind of wipe these guys out as we go. So that way we have more room to expand. But I think that's iron up there. Which is very l lucky of us. So let's kind of zoom in here. I think that's stolen this stuff. Yeah, so that is iron. Uh, but there's stuff there. Crap. Okay. Uh, it's going to be a bit tricky. But we're going to have to work on that somehow. Uh, let's see what we got left for some time here. Th uh, about three minutes. Okay, so basically what we can... Um, how do I get out of this? Okay, so what we can do... Oh, what's going on here? Well, that's strange. I guess... Oh, because... Oh, okay, I see. Because we need the fuel for all this stuff. For the plates. And uh, there's just kind of like a... a yeah, the backlog cleared up so there's not a backlog anymore that's kind of cool but see yeah that's exactly what I expect if I need to increase production of this stuff I can always build two more but for now I should check on the power consumption too Ooh, I think we're we're capping out so we need another steam engine let's build another one which means that we can just add another one down here where are we and I want to actually add a pipe in between because what you can do with these pipes is you can kind of mouse over them and see the temperature of the water. If that water temperature goes down, then you know that, that you got problems. So let's grab this guy. Um, is that the right way? I don't think it matters, does it? And then we need power poles to connect the buggers. There we go. So now that helped with performance. If I right click on these, or left click, you'll be able to see the power consumption, but uh, briefly. <laughs> so I need something that is only red packs. Looks like this one, the bullet, the bullet speed, which is good. Uh, what's the power consumption? Okay, left click. Let's do 10 minutes. I wonder if this is all the stuff I've added. The little inserters there. But now it looks like production is at... Uh, is not all 100%, which is good. Okay, perfect. So yeah, so we're almost done for this episode. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Uh, we're kind of setting up our area here. We got the iron, what little iron we have here, and we got this iron here. So, so I think what might have to happen is we might have to work our way towards the trains. Uh, if I can find the trains in here, there's even flight for airplanes. Right here, the railway. We'll need to work on the railway, which means we need to get the green science packs. So that's our priorities: green science packs, and we'll have to somehow create that over here maybe um, try and think how we're gonna work all this we're gonna have to expand our defenses out probably even I have to put a couple guns out here and yeah so thank you everybody for watching I appreciate you watching this video hopefully you've enjoyed yourselves I know I sure have and you all have a great day and thank you and I'll see you in the next episode Bye-bye.